Hello everyone, this is me, Sabja here, and I'm back with the monthly read for the month of April 2024. This reading is going to be for the sign of Gemini. So Gemini, so let's see what's coming in for you for the month of April 2024. I will be adding a lot of many cards here in this reading, so stay tuned. And before I dive into the read, let me remind you, it's general reading. It may, it may not resonate with everyone out there. Pick whatever resonates and leave the rest for personal reads. You can always reach out to me on my email ID in the description box. You can also check out other services that I offer as well in the description box. So let's see. Gemini, what can you expect for the month of April? Compromise, making changes. Marriage, sacred union. Party, having fun. Underneath the deck, we do have silence, no contact. Hmm. I really feel like, you know, uh, Gemini's, um, I really feel like, you know, for some of you, you might be in a no contact with uh, someone specific right now. Um, I really feel like, you know, maybe the no contact situation that you have been having with the specific someone could be because they are not ready to, um, ready to give you commitment maybe they are not ready to give you the love that you want the love that you seek um i really feel like you know this no contact situation is going to make you realize a lot of things that you could not realize otherwise um i really feel like you know if you want to get married to this specific someone and if you want commitment with this specific someone i really feel like you know there are certain things that you probably will have to sacrifice um, you will have to compromise for to get married to this person. This this person is not like you know the marriage, the commitment with this person is not going to be easy. It's it's like something that you will have to sacrifice a lot for, and then only there is a chance that you could have what you want with this person. Um, I really feel for majority of you, this uh, month of April is going to be the time where you are going to realize one thing uh, for sure that. If you want to get married to this person, um, you have to sacrifice, you have to compromise. Whether you are ready for that or not, that's something that you're going to decide during the month of April. It is going to be a big decision of your life. So you're going to take your time and decide what you believe is the best thing for you to do. Um, I really feel like, you know, for a majority of you, if you choose to uh, move on, move forward with your life, um, I really feel like, you know, you can still find a perfect match for yourself. But with this person, I really feel like you will have to compromise. You will have to sacrifice a lot. Um, but if you choose to move on from this person and you choose to move on to a better person or better partner, I really feel like your life would be more fun. Your life is going to be more easy and uh, you are making it difficult for, for yourself by sticking around this person and choosing this person as your partner. Uh, which is the reason why you're like unable to kind of like, you know, move your love life forward. You have to wait still with this person, whoever it is that you are dealing with. But if you choose to move on, I really feel like, you know, your life is going to be more fun, happy uh, content as compared to what your life would be, even if you get married to this person. So for some reason, I really feel like, you know, this person is not the perfect choice for you. Um, I feel like, you know, you can have more happy, loving, fulfilling life if you... Um, if you could move on from this person because right now you are unable to see what's uh, between the lines look for what's hidden i really feel like you know for majority of you you really feel like your person whoever it is that you're dealing with they are your perfect match this is one person that you want but this person cannot cannot give you the happiness that that love that affection that you truly desire and i feel like you know that's something that you are unable to understand you believe that this person is your wish fulfillment but this person will never be able to fulfill your wishes so i really feel like you know that clarity that understanding is going to come to you in the month of april and then only you will be able to make a decision about your life overall for some of you um i really feel like you know this this person has been keeping you stuck with them and probably they are still not ready to give you the commitment that you desire 
and if you complain that your love life is stuck i feel like it's because of this person and if you choose to move on you will be getting married with this person you might get married you might end up marrying with this person but it's not going to be an easy journey it's not going to be an easy situation uh you will have issues you will uh have um you know um the connection that you wanted but you would not be having that happiness because there will be a lot to compromise but if you choose to move on there is something bliss filled with bliss and happiness waiting for you there i really feel like you know for a majority of you this connection that you have with this person who you want to get married to and you're kind of keeping yourself stuck on uh, i really feel like you know this person has uh uh been with you for years but they haven't given you the commitment that you want they haven't given you the respect that you want in a relationship so i really feel like you know this is not somebody that is uh, willing to give you the happiness that you seek in love but your call your decision but i really see that the month of april is going to bring you the clarity where you would be able to understand that why things have not been progressing with this person because they don't um have much to offer to you you this person could be a wish fulfillment but like i said earlier they will never be able to fulfill your wish but if you choose to move on your life is going to be more fulfilling and more bliss uh full and uh you will be happily connected or married to a person who is going to prove to be the best partner for you let's see more cards here what else is coming in for you in the month of uh, april i feel like you know you will be having that person coming in your life as well this new person let's see there you go lovers we do have the choice coming for you in the month of april which is why um i really feel like you know you will have to make a tough decision of your love life where you're gonna choose either one of these two people uh the one who is already a part of your life who's never given you commitment for years and then there is a per marriage proposal maybe coming in for you a person coming in your love life who wants to get married to you and uh, who is ready for a responsible relationship um yes somebody's coming and approaching with with a loving offer but you are having your guards up i mean the deck we do have the nine of wands i really see somebody approaching you for marriage commitment and you are going to be indecisive uh, for some of you it could be dealing with another air sign uh, or earth sign or fire sign specifically sagittarius so let's see what else is happening in the month of april for you what else do you need to know for the month of april <clears throat> caution find out more information don't overwork yourself again i really feel like you know you want this person i cannot emphasize enough on the fact that i'm picking up this connection that you have with a specific someone right now you want it you want it bad but you don't know how and what your life is going to be being with that person so right now maybe you feel that they are perfect partner but maybe their family is not going to love you maybe they are not going to accept you maybe you will have struggles maybe your person would leave you for the third party or something i we don't know but with all the cards here it's indicating that you will be happily married to someone or have a happily ever after with someone new if you just choose to move on from this current situation that is um you know that that you don't know even more about i feel like you know this person has been keeping you stuck with them for years right now maybe they are in a no contact situation and still they don't want you to move on so they have been using you or abusing your kindness and love for sure let's see what else is coming in in the month of uh, april for you let's see what do you need to be doing in the month of april effort go to the gym to exercise the divine really wants you to take care of yourself right now um let yourself be out and about because i feel like in you know, for majority of you you are unable to break free from the unhealthy habits right now which is one of which is like you know this person and talking to them as well when you are out and about you realize your worth or you realize what people have to offer what the world has to offer to you make sure that you're doing something that makes you feel good and active and you know that keeps you busy as well uh and this possibility is plant a tree i feel like you know for those of you who feel that maybe if this connection ends you will never find someone again this is like you know something that you are unable to see right now there are un there are endless possibilities out there and you just have to open yourself up to that um so yeah let's see more cards here what else is the guidance for you for the month of april 
difficulties, jealousies from others may serve as obstacles to success of this connection. I really feel like, you know, for some of you, you are not moving on from your current situation, even though this is toxic person, somebody who is in no contact with you right now, somebody who wants to hold you back from moving on to a healthy relationship. They are jealous of you moving on. Maybe they are already themselves with some someone else. So I really feel like, you know, you have to understand very clearly what this person has been doing to you. So there are some difficulties that you are having to move on from this person. And it's like the main reason is this person has nothing good to offer, but they are addicted to you. Maybe they cannot like let you go easy. So they are gonna become an issue in this connection. So make sure that you choose wisely again I feel like, you know, if your relationship has not been working out, maybe somebody from the past has been influencing your uh, love life in a negative way. Just be aware of that as well. So, yeah, that's uh, pretty much it coming up for you in the month of uh, April. If it was of help, do like, share and subscribe. And if you are willing to purchase any of the services that I offer, check the description box. And if you are willing to purchase palm readings with me, check the description box for that as well. And reach out to me on the email ID mentioned there. Till I do the next reading for you guys, take care and bye.